feel like it's been ages since I've made a video. For the past week and a half, Steven's not even been here and I've I've been very sad. People kept asking me like, why have the videos slowed down a little bit? Why why aren't you posting as much? Where's Steven? I've not seen Steven. Like people that live around here and like the, my friends and stuff. And you guys obviously through the comments and I just kept saying, I think he's off and he's migrated to Norway because his type of seagull does that this time of year and last year. I didn't really see him through the entire winter from like October till February. I didn't really see Steven from when we moved in in July that year. So yeah, I thought this was just Steven's time to migrate and he was off. Him and Cliffy left to Norway and I wasn't going to see him until February next year and there wasn't going to be any videos until then. Well actually, I have an idea for a series when Steven leaves and that's going to be really fun. When he does leave, I'll tell you guys about it. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> I've not seen Steven all week and I've missed him a lot and I actually fed him this morning which I didn't really speak on but I filmed it and I want to show you guys so I'm going to cut to that. Steven's morning snackle and then we'll give him his dinner right now. realize how much you miss something until it's gone and Steven he's like my son honestly and the saddest thing was Steven's left I miss making the videos every day but there's so much Steven stuff around this house we've got these little figures that's got Steven on my head and then we've got this giant well not giant these are just really small but then we've got this bigger <laughs> little Steven statue that just watches me at my desk all day Tuna Babuna. Oh, that was close. <laughs> the window's so dirtier than ever. It's starting to look almost moldy. like a week and a half, Steven's feathers have gotten so much more brown and his feet have gotten so much more pink. Some soggy tuna. I got a comment on my last like fan mail sort of video that someone said it was boring and I kind of agree for some people yeah they don't want to see me open mail but for me I, I like doing it and I like getting mail that's why we opened up the P.O. box I also think it would just be so cool for this person who sent something to actually see it in a video and there's only two of them so I want to show you guys because they're really nice a little girl called Nova or boy Nova's a girl's name yeah drew this amazing drawing of Cliffy I don't like dead. Very true. And then Steven saying, I heard that. Also true. And this one is Cliffy and Steven Jr. and Steven on the window. But they're fighting over some food. Just a little portrait of Steven Jr. Amazing. <laughs> and then this one, I think this one's just Steven. Hi, bye, food, question mark. <laughs> Pretty much sums up me and Steven's entire relationship. <laughs> Hi, bye, food, question mark. That's pretty much it. It's all it needs to be. It's simple. I give him what he wants, he gives me what I want. A friend. These are two postcards, kind of, I think. 
the person who sent them, their mum paints them. So there's one of this little fish, because she said she knows Stephen likes fish. And then we've got this one, which kind of looks like Stephen if he went to some hippie festival and got all tie-dyed up. Stephen at Woodstock. The letters that she sent are both very long, I'm not going to read them out in the video. But Susan, this made my day, it was so lovely to read them. I don't know, it makes me so happy, people just seeing how much they love the videos and how much they enjoy them. And how much they like make bad days better for them. Because it doesn't feel like that when I'm posting them, I'm just, I'm editing something that seems silly. And then I post it, and then the response always just blows me away, and it, it's, it's amazing. It makes me feel like I'm doing so much more than what I actually am. But it's great, like I, I love that you guys love it, and I love that I can give them to the people that love it. <laughs> she said that everyone in her family sends her these seagull themed stuff because all she talks about is the videos. And I find that really funny. It's kind of like me, anytime I do anything, Isla's gran, my girlfriend, any gifts will be related to the thing that I'm doing. I used to be skateboarding, now it's Steven. They're the ones that got me the little Steven figure. And then my friend Rosie got me our figures with Steven on my head. It's very nice and it made me very sad while Steven wasn't here. Is it time to go? See ya, bitch. Boy. It's winter plumage. So yeah guys, this video was just a bit of an update on what's happening with Steven. I'm really glad he came by and I just got to see that he was doing okay and that he was healthy. And it's also, it's nice to see that Cliffy's kind of keeping away and he's not interrupting Steven's meals. I do still think Steven will migrate soon and when that happens, the videos will probably stop for like a couple of months. But in between that, I do want to do that series that I'm thinking of. Let me know what you guys think about a series of us going, well me and maybe a friend or my brother, going on a little travel across Europe to try find Steven, putting up posters, doing meetups, meeting you guys who live in different cities across Europe, just kind of hunt for Steven and try find him. Which, <laughs> probably impossible, but I think it would just be fun to go across Europe, meet people and just try find Steven. Maybe see some of the clues that he's left me across the way in different countries and <laughs> also a little update on the bird aid stuff i think so far we've helped raise about ten thousand pounds the merch so far has raised about two thousand six hundred pounds maybe a little bit more i think i think a bit more i can't thank you guys enough for helping out bird aid and showing your support because they do need it a lot Links to them are going to be in the description of this video as well. And then over on their Just Giving link, it's kind of hard to tell how much we've helped raise, but there was so many just Steven related donations. Like a lot of money, like some people are donating a lot of money towards it. And seeing Steven's name under these huge donations was just ridiculous. I think overall, so far we probably raised around 10 or 11,000 pounds for Bird Aid, which is just incredible just made me feel really nice and I want to thank you guys for your support in both Bird Aid and this channel over this past year. It's changed everything for me. <laughs> I hope Stephen comes back tomorrow, we can film another video and we'll be filming videos all the way up until he decides to migrate, if he does, if he chooses to do that. I think he will. And when that happens I will be sad but for now I've still got my buddy. Also, sorry if this video was a little bit boring. It was just quite nice to film a relaxing Steven video now that Cliffy wasn't here. It's really nice. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.